Will Io DeSumo be back at Illinois next year? That's the question a lot of people are asking. The Illini guard came back for his sophomore season to take care of some unfinished business. But regardless of whether he suits up in orange and blue again, his legacy remains. WCIA 3's Marley Weirda has more. Ayo DeSumo high-fived fans and gave his family a hug after beating Iowa in the regular season finale. The Illini sophomore didn't know at the time it would be his last walk off the court this season, one he dedicated to the fans. For them to have this success, um, I I'd really do it for them because they really deserve and they really earned it. And we, we just trying to, you know, make noise in the, in the postseason. While those dreams were cut short, his legacy will be ingrained in Illini Nation. As a four-star recruit out of Chicago, he was a top 50 player nationally with several Power 5 offers, but chose to stay home. Being from Chicago, Illinois my whole life, that just made everything much easier for me. He was the first true freshman in school history to lead the Illini in scoring. DeSumo turned down a chance to enter the 2019 NBA draft and returned to Champaign for another season to take care of some unfinished business of leading the Illini back to the big dance for the first time since 2013. I just believe in this team a lot. I feel like we can accomplish so much. I see a lot of things that I didn't accomplish yet and a lot of things I need to accomplish. And he, and, he and I... Had a, had, a, had an unbelievably common link in terms of wanting to see this thing grow. And, he, I mean, his pride is, is, is second to none. And sure enough, he started taking care of business. DeSumo was at the helm of a historic season for the Illini, winning the program's most Big Ten games since 2005. This season was highlighted by his big shots in late-game situations. Find anybody who's better, find anybody who's made more game winners, impacted a, a, a team, impacted a program. But his career was met with some adversity. This season against Michigan State, DeSumo silenced the State Farm Center after going down with a leg injury in the final seconds. He only missed one game, but DeSumo bounced back in impressive fashion, finishing his last six games, averaging 19 points. One of his most impressive post-injury performances was scoring a game-high 24 points to lead the Illini to a win at number nine, Penn State. DeSumo defined himself as a player that loved to play on the road. The mama mentality, I just knew that, you know, our team needed a win. This would be a big win, so I just wanted to come out here and do whatever I can to help my team win. My love for Io runs well beyond what you guys could even imagine. You're talking about a, a, a young man who was getting ready to perform on the stage that he loved the most, and that was the big stage. But the Illini didn't get their chance to dance, with the NCAA tournament ending before it started. If DeSumo decides to turn pro, he'll leave with unfinished business, but has left an unforgettable mark on Illinois basketball. Reporting for your Illini Nation, Marley Weirda, WCIA, 3 Sports. Thank you, Marley. No doubt Io is going to be remembered for a long, long time.